All right, people. So let's talk about this spiritual family. Let's talk about this. All right. So empty vibrational beings, right? Listen up. You know, being beings who are chosen ones or cosmic beings, soulful beings, solar beings, what have you. You know what I'm saying? They always deal with some shit. They always deal with some shit. They always deal with these random challenges by these empty vibrational beings, you know, that get sent by the fucking demon mainland slave owners, right? And that shit is fucking, it's a nuisance. It's it's like a nuisance. It's a fucking thing that don't need to exist, you know what I'm saying? Because a lot of cosmic beings have always experienced empty vibrational beings coming into their life to make their life like hell or some shit like that. When it's already a fucking hellish, toxic, anti-freedom systems in all of our damn universes. Because the universe with Earth on it ain't just the only universe that has a lot of fucking empty vibrational shit going on. It's, it's all of our universes that we soulful beings created. And these empty vibrational beings need to be fucking erased out of existence. You know what I'm saying? And it makes fucking sense to say that shit. You know what I'm saying? It makes fucking sense. It makes fucking sense to say this shit because what's the point of having these empty vibrational beings in our lives that 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 will come and try to make our life like a living fucking hell when it's already hell to fucking pay just to fucking live at some homes and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Like that's already hell to deal with. You know, empty vibrational beings could be, quote unquote, you know, toxic ass, sociopathic, psychopathic agents and shit like that. You got different type of fucking empty vibrational agents. You got the ones who want to act like a mobster in the, in the streets. You got the ones who be the judges at the courthouse. You know, all these fucking high tier toxic ass organizations and shit. You know what I'm saying? You got so many empty vibrational beings everywhere and they all work together. You know what I'm saying? These empty vibrational beings, they come from these higher tier organizations. You know what I'm saying? And you notice, know man, let me tell you something. A lot of Cosmo beings, right? You know, they can even have empty vibrational beings in their biological families. It is true. Because, like, you know what I'm saying? There's empty vibrational beings every single biological families and shit. And a lot of the chosen ones in the biological families, you know, they have to bow this shit Every single day during this fucking D room alien versus soulful being spiritual warfare. You know what I'm saying? It's definitely not bullshit. You know, it's, this ain't no fairy tale shit. This shit is nonfiction. This shit is happening every day as we speak. You know what I'm saying? There's cosmic beings out there who do so much for the fucking cosmos, put their all into the cosmos, doing everything to team up with the cosmo family, unleashing their talent, unleashing the fucking deep mind, heart, and soul. To the damn Cosmo family to heal the Cosmos. And yet, them same chosen ones will have some fucking empty vibrational being in a biological family. That will always call them these empty vibrational names and shit. You know what I'm saying? And that's fucking true how it happens. Because there's a lot of cosmic beings out there who deal with a lot of empty vibrational beings in biological families. Or even non-biological. It could be... You know, empty vibrational beings in their neighborhoods, the particular area that they are living in. You know what I'm saying? But imagine this. Imagine if an empty vibrational biological being, you know what I'm saying? Just randomly, like, you know, you, you, you just getting up. You're just getting up from a fucking good ass rest. Have an ultimate rising, ultimate all verse rising, chilling, and then... You wake up from your great rest and some fucking empty vibrational being has the nerve to call you these fucking slave minded ass empty vibrational word spell names. Like imagine waking up getting called a cracker or a nigga or a bitch. And you're the complete opposite of that. But that empty vibrational being, you know what I'm saying? Just doing that shit. To fucking mess with your fucking energy so you don't fucking thrive during your day. Because empty vibrational beings say empty vibrational word spells to fucking take you off your path. You know what I'm saying? Man, I'll tell you, man. I wish a fucking empty vibrational being would try to like, you know, 
say to call me a nigga when I'm waking up. I'm going to have to fucking erase them off existence. I'm going to have to. I'm going to have to fucking do it. I'm going to have to do it. Because that shit is uncalled for. And like the history lesson, it ain't no, it ain't no point to break down the origins, the empty vibrational word spell of these empty vibrational name callings like nigga, cracker, bitch, and stuff like that to an empty vibrational agent being who purposely do that. You know what I'm saying? It ain't no point to do that shit, you know? It ain't no point to do that shit because they do that shit on purpose to drain your fucking energy. There's empty vibrational beings every motherfucking where. There, you got empty vibrational beings who hardly got shit on their social media page and shit like that. They always want to talk shit to the soulful beings who got a lot of stuff they post and stuff like that. Connected with all Cosmo family and shit. You know what I'm saying? And those type of empty vibrational beings who so so quick to call you these empty vibrational names. Like the like cracker, nigga, or bitch. It's because they're afraid of your God self energy. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I've been called... I've been called a nigga before by a lot of empty vibrational beings. You know what I'm saying? It's because they intimidated by my fucking God self or or what we what I call it a God star or. You know what I'm saying? They afraid of that fucking chosen one or cosmic being or inside me that I navigate this fucking avatar to make the cosmo better because they know I'm a fuck up some shit. I'll fuck some shit up. I'll fuck an empty vibrational being up. You know this. You know this and you comprehend this. Cosmo family know what it is, man. You know what I'm saying? And I appreciate my Cosmo family that gravitate to my life and they make it much easier. You know what I'm saying? Um, Cosmo beings, right? We are all sick of empty vibrational beings. Whether that might be a motherfucking, you know, toxic organization. I will get in on that shit too. You know... These toxic organizations, they have a no snitch rule. They have a no snitch rule. That shit did not operate in the motherfucking neighborhoods. The no snitch rule happened in these high tier organizations, whether it be the police or whatever the fuck, man. Fraternities, they don't give a fuck. Out of all these toxic ass organizations, what have they done to fucking end the slave owners? Nothing. These fake ass judges ain't did shit to end the fucking slave owners. Nothing. Landlords, toxic ass agents. All these false ass saviors that portray themselves as fucking heroes or empty vibrational beings. I don't give a fuck who gets mad at this shit. The, the spiritually entombed beings who feel this shit, they know where I'm coming from. They feel where I'm coming from. Because I'm ready for this shit. I'm ready to end fucking toxic organizations. I'm ready to fucking put an end to these fucking demon or aliens. I don't give a fuck. It's time to end they fucking bitch ass. I'm, it's time to end all these fucking toxic ass organizations. I won't stand for it. I will not fucking sugarcoat shit for no fucking empty vibrational beings. At all, man. Because they these empty vibrational beings, where are they minions who work for the damn demon or aliens? Or they are the demon alien tyrants, you know what I'm saying? You know, they don't, they want you to be in fucking fear. They want you to walk around fear and be afraid to speak against them. But fuck all that shit. I'm going to speak against them, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to speak against them on my social media platform. I don't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? I don't give a fuck what an empty vibrational being got to say. You know what I'm saying? Because you know why? My fucking cosmic family is within me. You know what I'm saying? Just because, you know, a lot of empty vibrational beings... They always like to go against chosen ones because they feel like chosen ones are not affiliated with any toxic organization. They think chosen ones are fucking, you know, um, you know, they 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 like um, you know, they they think they won't fucking fuck some shit up, erase some motherfucking toxic ass being out of existence. Because me, I will erase a toxic motherfucker out of existence. You know what I'm saying? Just because I'm not affiliated with no toxic organization doesn't mean I cannot fucking throw down. You feel me? Man, I'm going to stand up for a bit. This stuff is crazy, yo. It's crazy how this shit is. Like, let me Man, we, we talking today, man. Like, these toxic-ass organizations, man, this is an uncut talk towards these motherfucking empty vibrational beings. 
You know what I'm saying? And yeah, empty vibrational beings can be in fucking biological families where it's a motherfucking sibling. You know what I'm saying? You name it. You name it. You know what I'm saying? A lot of these spiritually in tune beings, you know what I'm saying? The reason why the, the, the demon and the slave owners don't want cosmic beings to fucking connect physically it's because they know these demon alien slave owners know if if cosmic beings were to team up with me from all the universes that if, of all soulful beings from all the universes was to come team up with me in physical presence oh we gonna fucking take our cosmos fucking back and fucking heal the fucking universe because i'm tired of these motherfucking empty vibrational beings i'm really sick of them you know what I'm saying? Like, fuck all these empty vibrational slave owner beings, man. And especially these weak ass fucking landlords, too. Like, fuck them hoes. Like, any person who has the audacity to make somebody pay shit on time or else they don't live there, they're a fucking toxic ass motherfucker. That is cruel. Because me, look. You know this when you open your fucking balcony door or your door, period. You will always see like hornets or bees or, you know, make a make a, make a nest. You'll see a bird make a nest in near your near your home and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't destroy their fucking nest so they don't have a home to come to. But these fucking landlord, demon, alien, slave owners, they don't give a fuck about their citizens. They are fucking false ass saviors, false ass heroes. Fake ass motherfuckers, man. They don't care about no fucking universes, man. These demon alien slave owners, they gonna get a lot of shit handed to them infinite fold for all the fucking empty vibrational doings that they do. So fuck all the demon alien slave owners and fuck all the empty vibrational beings, man. They all deserve, yeah, the empty vibrational beings and the demon alien slave owners deserve to be erased. And that's that.